Perhaps the most chilling murder to date in 2021 happened in Upper Marlboro Saturday night, where someone outside shot into the home of 48-year-old Metro employee Sharon Redding. She died inside. The case remains unsolved. It was the capstone of a murderous month in the county. According to police, there were 16 killings in January of 2021, compared to just six during the same period last year. Four of the murders happened this past weekend. Major Brian Riley is in charge of the county's murder investigations. There's no, there's no, there's no uh, war going on out on the street between groups of people in Prince George's County. That is not happening. Uh, we are seeing the same trend as what we saw in 2020, and that is an argument takes place, anger happens in the middle of it, and then somebody pulls out overwhelmingly about 90 percent of our cases involving handguns and somebody is shot and killed. According to Riley, 80 percent of murder cases in 2020 resulted in arrests and charges. So far in 2021, 10 of the 16 murders have been solved with arrests, including four people charged with the murder of a store clerk in Fort Washington and five accused of stabbing a 16 year old on January 1st. One police officer was shot at while investigating a killing in Langley Park. Two teens were arrested in that case. Prince George's County Police say they are now approving overtime to beef up patrols and investigations in affected neighborhoods. But the reasons for the outbreak of violence at the beginning of 2021 remain elusive. Scott Broom, WUSA 9.